Today is all about the rise of the most modern and amazing space technologies from China, USA, and South Korea. There's a lot of things we can talk about when space technology is concerned. It includes space stations, spacecraft, space rockets, and many more. But today, let's just take a look at some of the most advanced, modern, and unbelievable space rocket launches done in China, USA, and South Korea for important missions. Hi everyone, this is Richard Aguilar and welcome back again to my channel. Now, before we get started, be sure to subscribe and be always notified of our new upcoming videos by clicking the notification bell. So without further ado, let's get started. Number 1 is South Korea launches its first homegrown space rocket. South Korea's first domestically produced space rocket reached its desired altitude but failed to deliver a dummy payload into orbit in its first test launch. The South Korean president still described the test as an excellent accomplishment that takes the country a step further in its pursuit of a space launch program. Live footage showed the 47-meter rocket soaring into the air with bright yellow flames shooting out its engines following blast-off at narrow space center the country's lone spaceport on a small island off its southern coast. After the launch, the Korea Aerospace Research Institute, the country's space agency, reported that Nuri's first and second stages separated properly and that the third stage carried the payload, a 1.4-ton block of stainless steel and aluminum 435 miles above Earth. But Moon, who served the launch at the narrow spaceport, said a televised speech that the payload did not stabilize in orbit after being separated from the third stage. Number 2 is SpaceX's Falcon Heavy Rocket Launch SpaceX's Falcon Heavy Rocket successfully lifted off, marking the towering booster's second flight and its first commercial launch. This was also the first time that all three of the rocket's reusable boosters returned safely to Earth. The Falcon Heavy roared into space from the Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral, Florida. The massive booster carried into orbit a 13,000-pound Saudi telecommunication satellite designed to provide television, internet, and mobile phone service to the Middle East, Africa, and Europe. The 230-foot-tall rocket weighs more than 3.1 million pounds and is made up of three reusable boosters based on SpaceX's Falcon 9 rocket, which has been ferrying cargo to the International Space Station since 2012. Number 3 is China launches first crewed mission to Tiangong Space Station. The first astronauts arrive at China's new space station in the country's longest crewed mission to date, a landmark step in establishing Beijing as a major space power. The trio blasted off on a Long March 2F rocket from the Duchuan Launch Center in northwest China's Gobi Desert and their craft docked around seven hours later at the Tiangong Station, where they will spend the next three months. State broadcasters showed a live feed from inside the spacecraft during the journey, with the three astronauts lifting their helmet visors after it reached orbit as one smiled and waved at the camera. Another floated a pen just off his lap in zero gravity as he browsed the flight manual. Number 4 is the launch of SpaceX Falcon Line rocket. SpaceX sent the latest cargo mission for NASA to the space station, with Elon Musk's company completing its 17th launch. The company's Falcon 9 rocket took off at the afternoon after Kennedy Space Center in Florida. 
the mission called CRS-22 has SpaceX's Cargo Dragon spacecraft carrying more than 7,300 pounds of research and supplies to the International Space Station. A few minutes after the launch, SpaceX landed the Falcon 9 booster, the largest bottom portion of the rocket, on an autonomous ship in the Atlantic Ocean. The Cargo Dragon capsule separated from the rocket about 12 minutes after liftoff, with the spacecraft expected to dock with the ISS. Number 5 is China launches New Earth Observation Satellite. China launched a New Earth Observation Satellite from Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center in northwestern China. The satellite Gaofen 302 was launched atop a Long March 4C rocket and has entered the planned orbit successfully. The satellite has been developed by the China Academy of Space Technology and the carrier rocket by the Shanghai Academy of Space Flight Technology. Number 6 is SpaceX launched NASA's IXPE Space Observatory. The IXP satellite will provide astronomers with a new tool to probe the mysteries of the universe. The refrigerator-sized satellite is equipped with three identical telescopes that will able to study the polarization of light, meaning which direction of light particles are scattered from cosmic sources such as black holes and neutron stars. With IXPE's observations, astronomers will be able to study the structure and mechanisms that power these types of enigmatic cosmic objects. So, I hope you found this video wonderful, and if you did, be sure to click thumbs up and share this with other people. Thanks for watching and see you in our next video.